Hopefully. Okay. Hopefully. Okay. Hopefully. Okay. I want to see. You don't get to see. You're nobody anymore. <laughs> it's over. Who wants you want these? Yeah, you can hold this little bag of bedazzled stuff. Okay. Mm -hmm. can you, can oh, that. here, give me that. You're going to be busy. Uh, we're, what's the best orifice? No, no uh, orifices. Uh, <laughs> we're going to give these to Tashina. Harvey's going to rummage through this bag, all the blings in there. You can make them bleed, yeah. She's excited for blood. All the blood. <laughs> so, you guys, 32 years we've been doing this. Woo! 32 years for the Mr. and Ms. Gay title. 43 years for the court in general, raising money for the community, so that's pretty amazing. So now we pass on the reins to people who are gonna hopefully do amazing things. Yes. Honestly, sometimes the gays don't do much, but they have duties. It's true, sometimes they just vanish. It's true. I was the last one standing in my last reign. I'm ready. Please welcome to the stage. Mr. Gay Edmonton, 32, Colin Bay, and Ms. Gay Edmonton, 32, Fairmont Yeah! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And they're matching, and they're wearing purple. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so Before we crown these two suckers, I want to have, hear a lot of noise for all of our other candidates in the back room. They're not going to come out and receive their accolades. They're just drowning their sorrows in the carpet. <laughs> Thank you, you guys. You did a great job tonight. Okay, go away now. <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm in the way. Spotlight. Okay, there we go. All right. As Mr. and Ms. Gay Edmonton 32, you are spokespeople for the Imperial Sovereign Court of the Wild Rose. You represent the LGBT2S plus community of Edmonton. I don't want no drunken craziness going on. I don't want no get shit. Oh, come on. Your only obligation is to represent this community and be fabulous all year long. Return 365 days from now, plan a pageant equally as fabulous as this, or I will kick your butt. Do you think you can handle that? Please say I do. I do. I do. All right. Then without further ado, let us present the regalia of the gays. Accessories. They have a lovely medallion for Mr. Gay, Colin, and sashes for each person. Handcrafted by myself and Michaels. <laughs> yes. Just ram it on and make her bleed. You said you wanted to make her bleed. But not in the bangs, yeah. Uh, put it a little higher. Yeah, you gotta be able to see it. Alright. Darla? No cupcakes for you. You're gonna swear. There's nothing to connect it to. Oh god. Ivana, it's her first time. There's so much hair. There's so much hair. <laughs> That's what they all say. <laughs> you never get to be president of the College of Monarchs ever. I also missed the hole. There's little rings in there, see? I know, I missed it. Oh. <laughs> she missed the hole. It just has to stay on so she can stand up. Hold on, two seconds. All right. Wait patiently. Did you all have fun tonight? Yeah. Yeah. Um, don't forget to check out our Facebook page. There's a lot of events happening between now. We've got Entertainer of the Year and other stuff. <laughs> the Princess Birthday Show, which will also be also Monday, we will be approving our candidates for Emperor and Empress. I can't say who they are at the moment until they're approved. But next week, campaign for Emperor and Empress 40. Four will officially begin as well. Here are these sorry kids? All right. Mr. Gay Edmonton 32, Colin Bay, and Miss Gay Edmonton 32. Paramount Kills Rise! And Green Hair People! There, all right. They're going to stand here, and you can all hug and kiss them and wish them 